Take off the slow-mo. Hey guys, it's Michael with Mikey's Adventures. <laughs> <laughs> and what did you think of Backlash? Guys, it was a very sad day. <laughs> You're not recording, are you? Yes. Oh, well, it's a very sad day. <laughs> the terrorists have won. <laughs> uh, Jinder Mahal, the Indian not terrorist, uh, won. If you give us 50 million likes, 50 million with the five zero, we will burn doing? this for 50 million likes. 50 million likes? Who wants 50 million likes? How about you have 50 million views that You're equate into money, you fucking cunt knuckle? Likes don't do shit except make you feel better. Likes? Because nothing else is going on but in your life. The way they have to like is they have to view the video. This so you'll still get viewership. Will now be known in Trump's America as a symbol of hatred <laughs> and extremism <laughs> due to. Terrorist Jinder Mahal. The Maharaja one. The Maharaja, the Maharaja of, one. of terrorism. <laughs> this is what this stands for anymore. He's Indian. You know who's turning in their grave right now? Sergeant Slaughter. He's you know alive. He's <laughs> well, let me finish the joke. I was going to say, you know who's swimming his, flipping his grave right now? Sergeant Slaughter. You know who, uh, what else? He's not actually dead. <laughs> but he's upset about this. <laughs> and he's not okay with Jinder Mahal, the terrorist, <laughs> winning the title. Now, why do you call him a terrorist, Jason? Well, let's keep going. We got the important out of the way. Can I can't believe a terrorist won. It was my understanding that the WWE was an American company, and we didn't negotiate with terrorists. <laughs> But apparently everything's upside down and now we're giving title belts to ISIS, which they're going to use for propaganda and they're going to win. <laughs> Trump is doing great things. So we'll start from the beginning. Pre-show Ty Dillinger versus... Perfect 10 versus Drama King Aiden <laughs> English. And I thought it was a good match. It was a good entertaining match and I like Aiden English character now. And he's away from that stupid. The vaudevillians, villains. Vaudevillians. 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 There is an old character from NXT that we used to watch. All he needs is a little rose he used to come out with. Yeah. Come out with and no, we need people throwing roses at him. And then they had a little spotlight on him. Uh, so Aiden English lost. Should and not have done that. Do you think he's going to cry? Yes. Yes. So we gotta wait till Tuesday to see if he cries. What was the first match of the show? First match was Chinsuke Nakamura. Chinsuke Nakamura versus Dolph, Dolph Ziggler. Ziggler. I and always want to call him Dolph uh, Lundgren. Kinshasa. Can you imagine if Dolph Lundgren. Ziggler was actually just Dolph Lundgren? <laughs> like he goes into the ring and he's like, I must break you. <laughs> every, every time he goes into a wrestling match. You didn't like the match. I didn't like the match because I don't like the people in it. <laughs> uh, Shinsuke Nakamura. Shinsuke Nakamura came out, got his ass whooped for ten minutes, and then won in two. <laughs> I don't, I don't like that With style. With the Kinshasa, you know, God, the Kinshasa, just so everybody could fucking yell it. <laughs> Kins, Kinshasa. Oh, can you imagine if Ronaldo got to yell Kins, Kinshasa? <laughs> oh, can hell you, yeah! Fire JBL. Hashtag Fire JBL. God, bullying. Has its place, and that place is in the WWE. <laughs> That's what I got to say. If you're gonna bully someone, be a bully in the WWE. Where's the wisdom by Jason? Or in real life, because fuck people. Gives a shit about them. <laughs> anyway, uh, who was next? It was, uh. Was it the girls? No. Mm -hmm. We're missing a match right here. We condone bullying. Uh, the tag team. I yes. think it was a tag team, yeah. Uso versus Prince Pretty and... Freeze Angle. Dango. Well, it, to be honest, the team was the Usos versus Fandango with and a janitor. janitor. Mm. And then Fandango with Grandma. And then <laughs> Fandango with Tyler Prince Bree. Pretty, Tyler Breeze. Who is what did, what did Fandango say? You're the prettiest of the pretty princes or something? <laughs> no, he said, you're, yeah. the, you're, the, you're the prettiest prince of all the princesses. Ah, you're but the prettiest it? prince of all the princesses. Yeah. But now princesses. No. Like princes. With a S. Yeah. Princesses. 
Prince Zai. I think you'd call him Prince Zai. Prince Zai. I don't know. And the Usos won. And the they fucking Usos. And they stay the is H. <laughs> <laughs> what does it say? Day one I is H? Yeah. <laughs> Look at these shirts. Day one is H. <laughs> That's pretty funny. They should have won just for that joke. Then our day will be H. Uh, and then what happened? What are you looking at? Then we had the well, Kevin Owens, I think, match. <gasps> no. No, it was the ladies then. No, oh, we're missing a match. Oh, hey, off topic, when no. they come out, we should buy the plates of the Maharaja. Do not. <laughs> I'll never step foot in this house. You just that terrorist. <laughs> There you go, Baron Corbin. It was Baron Corbin versus... You said terrorist. I remember Sami Zayn's letters. <laughs> Baron Corbin versus Sami Zayn. Sami Zayn's got terrorist writing on his junk area. Used to. He's no, still... he still does, except yeah. now he's got words on the side that say resist despair. And that's his name, by the way. What? That writing. It's nobody. It's terrorist writing. <laughs> Maybe it's his name in terrorism. Yeah, <laughs> and that was an okay match too. I liked it. It was, was fine. Good. Sami Zayn won. He needed to. What is his face? Baron Corbin didn't. But fucking yeah, he needs the win every <laughs> once in a while, guys. You got to give it to him. Um, then we had Kevin Owens versus AJ Styles, which is a phenomenal match. It's very no good pun match. Pun intended. You That's are a phenomenal a one. <laughs> 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 No pun intended. I said no pun intended. I hope to use those um, those jokes when I'm teaching the Wait. science class in the inner city high school. Wait, so isn't Jason the terrorist holding a terrorist belt? Yeah, but it's not the terrorist belt. I'm taking it back for America. <laughs> I'm taking it what back. What fell off? Yeah. What fell off of where? Huh? Nothing. Why? Did they see like, oh, the logo. Never mind. Don't stop Ruining everything. We had a good <laughs> no, conversation. Like this, like, okay, both there. So Kevin Owens won. AJ Styles' leg got stuck in the hole. Yes. <laughs> that was the best slash worst ending ever. <laughs> was that <laughs> AJ Styles stands up at a desk and then falls <laughs> through it, getting tangled in the wires. I mean. If you didn't know wrestling was fake, you'd be like, what an outrage. How did this how did this travesty happen? And is AJ Styles okay? But good news is it's all fake. Just like outer space. Ah, there you go. The globe and what this used to mean. Pride in America. I know oh, Cole used to have that title. I know it says world. But we don't mean that. World means America. <laughs> oh, he used to carry that title with the American flag. He was well, not exactly that. He one, was but... a real American. He fought for the right of every man. Where's Hogan right now? We need him. Uh, he's in Florida selling old bandanas because he's fucking <laughs> so sad that he can't be in the WWE anymore. <laughs> then we had the girls match, which was okay. Becky Lynch, Natalia, the Red Rooster, the Red Rooster. Uh, Carmella. I'm just trying to remember if I know everybody's name. Uh, Naomi. Uh, which is good, because I could have just said the black one, but I remembered her name. <laughs> You're all gonna shake your head at me after a terrorist <laughs> just won the world championship? I think not. It's a great time in our world. <laughs> no, but we won't buy the Maharaja plate segue. Yeah. Anyway, what's the other... Hold on. Got Naomi, uh, Natalia, uh, Tamina Snuka. <laughs> God, glad her star is finally and fucking taking off. And the main diva, off. you guys are forgetting. Yeah, Charlotte. Charlotte. Jeez, I forget she's on this no, B-list show. No, well, then the main diva, Ellsworth. <laughs> Ellsworth. Oh, stupid. I don't care about Ellsworth. The big hog. I don't like him. The big hog. The big hog. Chinless. Chinless. Aggression. <laughs> His name should be Shinless Nakamura. <laughs> He should come out dressed like Shinsuke and act all gay. He could play another um, Gilbert. Gilbert. Yeah, that's where he's heading because he's a fucking no talent ass clown. Ellsberg. What were we talking about? What Ellsberg. match were we? The girls match. Oh. Natalia. Uh, Kamina. The, the Carmella. The black Kamina. one. Kamina. Who's Kamina? Nobody. <laughs> Tamina. Whatever. Anyway, Becky Lynch lost. To Natalia. Natalia. For the 
and nothing happened. But it was a good match. Oh, Charlotte, forget it. Charlotte is maybe she got hurt and like this is like what she's not so hurt she can't compete at like Raw because they're actually fighting over there so she's gotta <laughs> come to Smackdown where it's all divas and bullshit <laughs> by the way who's gonna be the next diva well we already know cause Eva Marie's gone next season you don't know Paige is gone Lana next is season. Lana Lana Lana's already there she's already in too many fucking scenes of Total Divas as it is Carmella she's putting nah, on well if they got Carmella I guess that'd be okay but Lana's the new diva yeah but yeah but she's already a who's diva gonna take on the show over other people who's taking the parts on the Total Divas show of Paige and Eva Marie Renee Young oh. Renee Young's already on I it too much I heard they were asking Sasha Banks Sasha Banks and Bailey. Carmella. Bailey won't do it. You don't know that? Nobody wants to see a 16 year old get ready for class Sasha matches. Banks. Sasha anyway. Banks and Carmella. I, don't, Charlotte. I wouldn't want to see Bailey's life for a million dollars. Well, I wouldn't see it for a million dollars. Ah. But, uh, then what? Luke Harper versus uh, You <laughs> took a pee Rowan. break. I didn't even pee during this pay-per-view, <laughs> but you did. You were like, fuck this noise. I'm out of here. <laughs> Uh, what you missed was absolutely nothing and a shit match that ended in what I saw. one of the two of them winning. Who cares? Luke Harper. What I that saw pushes was the okay. story forward. What I saw was okay, but it wasn't a match. Don't me. don't push Eric Rowan who just came back. Push Luke Harper who's got no storyline But he whatsoever. has a new cool mask. Yeah, but the guy with the cool mask lost. <laughs> anyway. And stupid. then we have... The main event, Randy Orton versus the This Maharaja. used to mean something, America. <laughs> this used to mean something. You know what I meant? No fucking terrorists allowed. <laughs> Jinder Mahal from India. Mm, right. <laughs> fucking ISIS operative number one. <laughs> oh, fucking the leader of fucking ISIL. Member of Al Qaeda. Wow. Wins the fucking championship. Doesn't mean anything. Anymore. This is getting cut, right? This is worthless. It's a worthless piece of leather and fake gold now, because it's owned by terrorists. I'll support it. Should we go melt it at five fifty million likes? Oh. He's from India. Yeah. yeah. He's from, from the part of India it, that blows every, up airplanes in the buildings. In reality, he's from Canada, Canada. but yeah. Well, in reality, he's. Fucking terrorist. <laughs> Jinder Mahal won. I, I'm he glad did, he won. He, he deserved it. He looks like he, one of those. He worked his ass off. In, in the words he of worked Drunk his Uncle, ass found off. it. White? <laughs> <laughs> Down south. Jinder Send Mahal. Him back. <laughs> oh, that was my favorite part of Saturday Night Live ever. <laughs> Down south. <laughs> Send him back. <laughs> Alex, Amazing. Well, you didn't like The Rock saying that he built a robot? No, I didn't like The Rock saying he built a child molesting robot. <laughs> okay, so at first I heard it and I was like, what? <laughs> and like started to laugh. And then I was like, wait a second, this is wrong. And then when they asked him, how do you get the robots to molest? He said, we molest the robots. No, nope, they continue to molest. Are you kidding me? <laughs> you know he was uncomfortable saying all that though. Everybody should be. And it shouldn't have been a sketch. One. Ridiculous. And then for it to end with White Castle. Ridiculous. And then who, which writer thought of that shit? I don't know, but I don't think he's got a job next season. I'm saying that right now. Uh, who, 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 uh, Lauren Michaels gets back there. Who wrote the uh, White Castle script with the... Uh, Child molesting robot. <laughs> Guy raises his hand real proud and he's like, You're fired. I don't know how that even got to air. God, how many people's eyes did that see? And they were all like, Hilarious. You know what we should make a joke about? Let's do a rape joke next week. Let's make a whole thing about how Vanessa Bear got raped. We'll make it real funny and then they can all go to Jack in the Box afterwards. Are you shitting me? It's Night just Night. not good. <laughs> but Drunk Uncle, always the best. <laughs> it's sad to see him okay, go. overall support. Arby's, we have the meats. <laughs> That's my favorite line. So I'm not Fast 8 Furious. Overall okay. for this. 
We're still so, talking. Exactly, and you, you haven't finished your last pay per view. Uh, Gender Mahal. Deserves it. <laughs> That's he not what we said. The, what did you think of it? The total. He worked his ass off. <laughs> he did not. He stole the belt like a normal terrorist would. God forbid they earn anything. They just fucking steal it. And then he's got his little cronies. You're watching this group. Cronies? Of Al- you got this group of Al Qaeda over here attacking. You got to deal with them. And you don't realize Osama bin Laden's behind you. Oh, wow. That's too far. It's too far. What do you think they're trying to push with this character? <laughs> do you know how many Indian people wear headscarves like that? Linda Zero, unless fire. they're Muslims <laughs> and they're extremists and they want to blow up our way of life. Right, Linda McMahon will get fired for this. <laughs> yeah, no, she fucking, they're all in on it. It doesn't matter. <laughs> Linda McMahon's in the White House now. She can do anything she wants. So, I gave the pay-per-view a... I was going to say eight and a half. I thought it was pretty good. Mikey? I'm going to give it a... I didn't even see half of it. I'm going to be honest. I'll give it a seven out of ten because I only saw a few matches. I was playing VR mostly. I'm giving it a nine eleven <laughs> <laughs> For the terrorists who Ooh, took this no. belt and our freedoms that day. <laughs> I'm not funny for, <laughs> for the people that have family from that time. Then they funny. should be just as pissed that a terrorist is now in possession <laughs> of the coveted WWE oh. title. <laughs> oh, our monetization is gone from this video. Listen, according to the news, if Trump's president, I could say whatever I want. <laughs> According to the news. According to every time you turn on the news, somebody's saying some new awful fucking thing, and it's just okay because Trump's president. The other day I saw like a guy in an airport, not like online, and like he was walking by some guy who was talking like Spanish to his mother on the phone, and the guy was like, Trump's gonna fix this place, you better speak English. Like I was like, what the fuck? <laughs> like we've come all the way back to a place where white people can just be like, Learn English! This America! Like, I love that time of the year because that's who I am deep down inside. Like, when Barack Obama was president, I couldn't talk about Jinder Mahal being a terrorist because he's a black Muslim leading the free world. (laughs) But, now that Trump's in play, I think Trump needs to call up WD and strip the terrorists of the belt. Did you say WD? Did I say WG? Maybe I did. Maybe I didn't. Maybe I said WA. Yeah, I don't know. Now you're talking about Jinder Mahal. So. <laughs> if I was talking Jinder Mahal, I'd be like, oh, no, 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 no. And then, I'm not born. I'm not born. <laughs> okay. And shoot a grenade over my shoulder because oh, I'm a fucking wow. terrorist. And then I get on a plane and hijack it <laughs> from Boston going to Los Angeles. I crashed it into a World Trade Center because my name was Jinder Mahal. That's too far. <laughs> and this is where monetization goes from here all the way down to zero. I'm sorry about this. People are looking at it right now and going, this guy's got problems, but it's Trump's America. You can say it. <laughs> We're allowed to say it now. I mean, I know you're not full white, but you can enjoy some of the freedom. You know what I mean? It's there for you. You're pretty good. This kid's going to pass as a whitey. I am white. Look at me. Mm-hmm. Oh, well, kind of repaint me white. Your metal mouth speaks different. <laughs> <laughs> if you were really white, you'd have Invisalign. Because Invisalign. white people get better things. So, uh, <laughs> so, it's what, called white privilege. So Check I'll, it out. I'll bring it back around. <laughs> what do you give SmackDown? A 9 I gave it a 9-11, <laughs> but I'll give it really a 7. And a 7-11. For Jinder Mahal, <laughs> who was oh, oh, oh. oh. there on the weekends, doling out slurpees. Um, oh wow! Well, listen, you guys keep pounding on me that he's Indian. It's the only other Indian job I know is to smell bad and scam it, scam. food, or to work at Seven Eleven. And scam, Jason. Don't forget about scamming. Well, that's more the Indians from India. <laughs> and Jinder Mahal's not from there. And Jinder Mahal's. From fucking Afghanistan, from the cave. <laughs> the fucking terrorist. Now he has this. You know how much fucking WMDs this is worth? 
like seven WMDs and he's got them now. What the hell's WMDs? Weapons of mass destruction. <laughs> You'll see. Next Paris attack, I know who did it. Jinder Mahal. This used to mean something. Used to mean something, America. Now it's just like going to school. Everybody can do it. White or black. Oh, wow. <laughs> or gray or brown. Whatever colors you want to say. <laughs> Fucking cunts. People get too crazy now, too. I saw this thing on The Bachelor. Uh, this guy was filling out a survey and it said, What's your biggest fear about The Bachelor? And he wrote, like, as a joke, he wrote, I'm scared that she's a dude. And people were like, how transphobic. It's like, uh, number one, he was making a joke. It wasn't that funny. And number two, I hope that it, he could be scared that it was a dude. Like, I wouldn't go on The Bachelor to date a chick that used to have a dick. Okay, well, we know where I'd stand on that stuff. Because you way. kiss one. <laughs> Come on. It also gave me a blowjob. Oh, oh no. <laughs> <laughs> oh, is this on the internet? <laughs> Forever. <laughs> I forgot. <laughs> you might have to bleep that one out. <laughs> Used to mean something. <laughs> now it's worthless. See? <laughs> the now crystals our in jokes it. jokes about him and Harold are real. Oh. <laughs> See, but that's where you're wrong, because I only do it after the surgery. Oh. Girl. <laughs> you guys say so, but... I think people would like fuck Caitlyn Jenner and not consider it gay, right? Is it gay? You Why? Mean the switch? No. Well, the switch is pretty gay. Uh, <laughs> the the actual switching. I'm stuck, Nintendo's everyone. <laughs> fucking idiot. I'm stuck. <laughs> yeah. No. You, ah! No. No. Push it down more. <laughs> idiot. Anyway. <laughs> Alright, end it. It's over. Why there's never been a greater act against humanity than this going to a terrorist. There's never been anything worse. Like, subscribe, favorite, share. Once again, like, subscribe, favorite, share. And soon you'll see the Maharaja place on here. Next thing you know, they're going to say Hitler did nothing wrong. <laughs> Really? I don't know what you're talking about. Point really? the camera to us! <laughs> the spilling of the batteries is brought to you by Jinder Mahal. Jinder Mahal. His terrorism knows no bounds. Alright, wrap it up. Wrap it up. Like, Go. subscribe, favorite, share. Like, subscribe, Woo! can't favorite, and share. Do your face. Do the Woo! face. There. Like, subscribe, favorite, we share, and watch it again. Like, subscribe, favorite, share, and I'll see you guys in another video. Bye. Terrorists never win. <laughs> there. You ass. Now you pick them all up. <laughs> you pick them all up. You shouldn't be you, a word. You put every battery on the floor. <laughs>